So the other day I found this awesome artillery shell from the American Civil War. And after rendering it safe, I decided to clean it up using a process called electrolysis. After dremeling off a little area so I could get a good electrical connection, I placed it down in a solution of baking soda and water. Hooking on my alligator clamp, I decided to run it on two amps, which is just enough to zap off the rust but won't damage the surface of the metal. And as you can see, it's bubbling pretty good. After just a few hours in the tank, you can see the rust is just coming right off. After putting it back in to cook for just a few more hours, you can see that most of the rust is gone now. And it just takes a little bit of wire brushing and work with a Dremel to remove the little stubborn pieces of rust that are left. And finally, after about 48 hours total of work, you can see there's no more rust on here. Now all that's left is to apply a thick layer of rust converter, which will neutralize any of the microscopic rust that's still on there. And once that dries, you can see we have a completely preserved and safe to handle artillery shell from the American Civil War. This one is a 20 pound short pattern artillery shell used in the Parrot rifle. 